Lobby Tools, legislative news and information systems on the web at lobbytools.com. Karen Long and her granddaughter Ayana are perusing the mall in search of Christmas presents. I think she's going to cost me a little bit, but I'm still going to try and stay within a budget for sure. Donna Mobley saved all year to buy gifts for her family. I won't spend as much because right now I budget for the things that they need versus the want. The Great Recession has changed people's shopping habits. The trend has been to spend less and save more. But this year, retailers say people are more optimistic about the economy. Uh, Americans are feeling more confident about their own financial situation. The Florida Retail Federation is predicting a 5.2% increase in holiday shopping. They say the average shopper will spend $750 on gifts, up 10 bucks from a year ago. The prediction comes as gridlock in Washington brings the country closer to the fiscal cliff. If Congress and the president can't make a deal by the end of the year, Florida families could see their taxes increase by $3,500. The shoppers say it's too early to be worried. Not before Christmas. We'll see what happens after Christmas. And retailers have this message for Washington. What a great Christmas present for all the citizens of America if they could get together and solve this problem now. While consumer confidence seems unfazed by the looming crisis, reaching a deal sooner than later could solidify the mood. In Tallahassee, I'm Whitney Ray reporting.